Hey guys, welcome to my channel. My name is Luke. Thank you very much for watching. I do appreciate it. Now, did you know that in the UK, a car is stolen every nine minutes? That's 154 cars each day. That's that's mental. I've recently been and bought a new car. It's a Honda Civic Type R. It's my pride, it's my joy, and the very first thing I got done with it was get a tracker installed. That way, if it were to go missing, if it were to get stolen, I would be able to find it. Now what you're about to see is a demonstration on how I would go about finding my car if it was stolen using the Track It 24-7 app. I hope you enjoy. Okay, so my girlfriend has taken my car. She's quote unquote stolen my car. Um, I now need to try and find that car and track it down. Luckily, I've got a tracker in the store, as I've already said. Um, I used a company called Track It 24-7. Um, primarily because my dad actually uses them with the company he works for. They specialize in fleet um, services. So they, they can put trackers on a fleet of vehicles, like a fleet of trucks. Uh, a fleet of machinery or anything uh, but you can also use it for personal reasons as well much as I have now today um, they've got loads and loads and loads of products I do have a couple of products on me that I will show you uh, including the TI 100 and the TI 920 um, and I'll talk to you a little bit about them uh, in a little while so I do have a screen recorder up on my mobile phone uh, and you can see that we're the blue dot and my car is obviously the red car um, so <laughs> the challenge today is to try and sneak up on behind my girlfriend catch her up and take control of my vehicle uh, before it obviously gets damaged or whatever um, in the 10 minutes a scenario that has been taken away or stolen now obviously it goes without saying that if your car is stolen in real life I do not recommend you go and track it, it down yourself uh, make sure you inform the police uh, and the authorities and uh, so they can try and help you get your car back. So it looks like she's heading towards Cricklade. So what I need to do at the end of this road, I, I need to turn left. Or do I try to be clever and I try and cut her up somewhere? No, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go left at these crossroads. See if I can come up behind her and see if I can catch her up. Okay, let's go left at these traffic lights. Let's go and get my car. <laughs> Come on! Okay, she's coming back down to Purton. If we turn right here, with that blue dot, we're going to turn right here at these crossroads and we're going to try and cut across. Okay, where's she going to go? If she turns right, then she's going to uh, end up coming past us. And if that's the case, then what we need to try and do is keep our cool. Imagine if it was a real thief and they've just stolen your car. They're not going to know if you're in another car or not, do you know what I mean? So if, we, if they do pass us, then we're going to need to turn around and try and follow them at a safe distance behind, and then of course let the police know where we are, so they can uh, try and uh, stop them for us. Which way is she going? Is she turn right or? I think she, she turn right. Okay, she's coming down this way. She's coming down this way. Now my particular tracker, I've got uh, a tracker called the 204, the TI 204. My um, tracker has a built-in battery which lasts up to a day. So if the suspected thief was to uh, find the tracker and or cut it off or take the battery out of the car and, and then lift the car onto a, to like a transporter of some sort, the battery itself within the, the there, she, there she is, there's my car. That's my car. I've just passed the thief. <laughs> right, we need to try and turn around now. Okay, we're just turning around. This is going to be a game of cat and mouse, I think, where I'm going to be behind her at all times until she stops. <laughs> but that's that's the thing, right? When the thief takes your car, they will eventually stop and you just need to be there to, to catch them at the other end with the police. Okay, we've turned round and we are now not far behind. Okay, it's just updated, okay. She's at the crossroads. <laughs> the same crossroads where we... Uh, 
we took left at earlier, that's where she is now. So when, when we get around this right hand bend, at the end of the road there's some crossroads. So right now we are behind her, we're, we're heading in the right direction at least. Before, we were trying to find her, trying to catch up with her. And now we're right behind her, we're going to uh, hopefully intercept our car. Is she got the red lights? No, she's no, just updated. Oh, she was at the red light, she's just, I think she's made a right hand turn. Okay, so not only can you track your vehicles using the app, like I'm doing right now, but you can also go on the web browser on your computer and you can track it uh, live, if you like, while in your office. So, for example, fleet management. If you've got a load of trucks on the road and you're in the office as a transport manager, you can uh, keep an eye on your vehicles where they are. And not only can you find out how fast the vehicle's going and uh, the direction of travel, but on both the app and the web browser, you can find out the historic travel of the vehicle as well. In other words, you can find out where it went and when it went on any particular day. You can select the day you want and it'll show you the route that the vehicle took, which can come in very handy, especially if you need to prove where you were at a certain point at a certain time during the day. Okay, we must be very close because it's saying that we've overtaken her. Of course, it updates every five seconds. I'm just waiting for it to update. Okay, she's at the end of the road. She's turning. She's turning right. I think she just turned right. Yeah, she turned right. Okay, we're close. We're close. Okay, we are very close. She's got to be. Is, she, is it one of those cars up ahead? I can't quite see. We're very close. We are very, very close. Okay, we've overtaken her again. Is it going to update? <gasps> I think we just passed her. I think, I think we just passed her. Okay, I've just stopped a second on this road here. If we go out and turn left, I think she's there. We have the ability on this app to press the satellite button, and it turns into. A satellite view. She's parked in Brick Arches car park. That's where she's parked. She is clever. She parked in there just as I went past it. <laughs> so I drove past her. So this potential thief, they've taken your car for a joyride and now they've dumped it in a car park. This is the point where you could be on the phone to the police telling them exactly where your car is. You need to get back up now. My my car's there. Come and help me get it. We need to turn right in here. She's in here. I've never been in here. Okay, we're gonna get under this. And there's my car. Not that one, this one here. <laughs> there it is, that worked. We found her. I found you! I found you. <laughs> okay, so here we are then, back in my car, back in my type R. We managed to track it down. The thief didn't steal it and get away with it. We're happy because our tracker managed to uh, help us get it back. So I thought now is a good time to talk to you about the trackers that you can get from Track It 24-7. Uh, as I said earlier, they do many, many different types of trackers. They can do trackers for fleet vehicles, they can do trackers for personal vehicles, and they come in all different shapes and sizes. You can even get personal ones that go in your pocket if you really wanted to. Now, before we do continue, I just wanna let you know that you can actually get 10% off your order if you use your discount code LUKEC. Uh, the code's up there on the top and the link is down bottom in the description. It applies to the trackers, so go and check that out. So this one here is the TI-100 GPS tracker. Uh, at the time of recording, this tracker was only 78 pounds. This is a tracker which is uh, one of their simplest trackers. It's very small as you can see, literally much, much smaller than my hand. Uh, and all you've got to do is find somewhere to affix that. It does come with sticky pad if you need it. Uh, and a very simple positive negative connection to the battery is all you need to get that one up and running. Uh, simple two wires uh, and it's also an IP67 rated um, case and it gives you a battery of about two to three hours so if they do cut the cord take the battery off you still got two to three hours battery within the unit itself that is the TI 100 
Now this is the TI 920, uh, as the number might indicate, 920 is a higher number, generally speaking, it means it's a better product. This is a even smaller device, much, much smaller, very tiny, but is actually an improved version of of the TI-100. This also has a two to three hour battery life. It also includes the ability to uh, immobilize it, which means you can disable your vehicle via the app if you so wish, uh, which all comes included in the kit. Um, and at the time of recording, costs exactly the same price, 78 pounds. So this is a slightly more sophisticated device than that one um, that is actually the same price. That is the TI-920, very, very small. Now, as I mentioned earlier on in the video, I've actually got a uh, 204, I believe it's called, yeah, TI-204, um, which is slightly more expensive than the versions that you've just seen. Uh, I don't have one to hand, because obviously it's in my car, but uh, if I just give you a demonstration quickly. So, they are the two that you've already seen. Um, so, if you look at there, look, you can see that's a picture there. That was the TI-100, and then we've got the TI-920, which is the even thinner one, you can see uh, just there. This one that I have is a TI-204, so as you can see, it's a lot bigger, uh, it's a bit bulkier, um, and there's reason for it, and that's because the battery life on this one is up to 24 hours. It's a much, much bigger unit, which allows, um, obviously, the battery to last longer, really, which can come in handy. Me, personally, I feel like if your car's going to get stolen, it's going to be during the middle of the night, uh, and chances are, by the time you wake up and realise it's been stolen, it's already going to be a good couple of hours before it's gone. That's just my personal opinion, which is why I went for the TI-204. Um, I did pay for it out of my own money. It wasn't given to me or anything like that. Uh, at the time of recording, it was £120. So it's not that much more money. It's only £40 extra than those two. But in my opinion, uh, is the far better superior unit. Uh, it also has the ability to have immobilisation, uh, uh, option on it as well and it also is waterproof IP67 rated as well so yeah that's just some of the uh, trackers that track it 24 7 do but as I said you, you've got to check out their website man they, they sell a lot of products for a lot of different things um, it's far too many to actually go through in one video Okay, so as mentioned, I've got the TI-204, which does have a 24-hour battery built into the device itself. Uh, the other two devices that I've showed you as well, they have a two to three hour battery internal backup. However, as with any device that track a 24-7 cell, if the unit itself is unplugged from the battery, so say, say the thief has found your car, uh, they want to get into it, they know you've got a tracker, they disconnect the tracker, it doesn't matter because you're still going to get a notification alarming you that that tracker has just been disconnected. So you're going to get a notification via a text message or email, whichever you set up, uh, you'll get that notification to say that the tracker itself has been removed. When you do find the device you want, so say for example you want the TI-204, which is the one I have, you just need to select a subscription package. I personally go for the monthly direct debit, which is £10 a month, or you can do prepaid at 6 months, 12 months and 24 months at £60, £120 and £240 respectively. Uh, but my, my advice is just go for the £10 direct debit, that way you know what you're spending each month. Okay, and there we have it. Car has been found nice and safe, as you can see. Uh, thankfully, because of the tracker, we managed to get it down to uh, just 15 minutes before I managed to find it, so it's actually quite ideal. Um, but yeah, track it 24-7. Keep the name in your mind. Remember, uh, you get 10% off if you use the code LUKESY. Um, that's the code LUKESY. Description is down below if you want to go and use that code. And yeah. Hopefully I'm never going to lose my car ever, ever again. <laughs> Thank you very much for watching. Do appreciate it. Until next time, drive safe, stay safe, keep your vehicle safe. We'll track it 24-7. I'll see you soon. Bye-bye.